I've spoken with the ghost of your daughter, Helgi. Really? How nice. You don't even care. She's your daughter. I have Alva to take care of now. I don't need Helgi anymore. What? Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. <laughs> yeah, so I bought a horse and I had it for all of five minutes. Remember when we were in uh, Markarth, I believe it was, and I was suddenly attacked by the Forsworn and the, the horse was instantly slain. He just viciously attacked the horse. It didn't even seemed like they didn't even know I was there, but yeah, that was 1,000 septums down the drain. Really disappointed, really. But thank you all for having breakfast with me. Um, I think today we're gonna start off, we need to go to the Dragonborn Gallery and drop off some things, <clears throat> like that Forsworn headpiece that you're wearing over there, Shirelia. It actually looks good on you though, but you know, it, it does have a, a spot in the gallery. Come on, let's go. I've also seen reports. We heading out? Let's yes, get going. We are. I've also got reports of uh some strange stuff going on in Morthal. We're gonna need to go there yeah. as well. About time, friend. <laughs> Here I, I was thinking I was going to have to kill something without you. Well, I thought you were enjoying our, our nice, friendly breakfast. Anyway, come on. Let's go. You know, I still can't believe that I'm Harbinger of the Companions. It's really a shame about Godlax. Fletcher's wine. Ugh. I don't like this city. Torch bug flying right in front of me. Well, it's good to see that it's uh, bright enough in here that we can see where we're going now. Kind of shadowy and eerie, though, but still nice. Hello there. Guess we're feeding our, our guests now. I suppose that's all right. Avram, is that you? It's kind of dark in here. You might Fine wanna day, is it not? Put a candle on the table. Okay, let's see. Still here. What have you got for me? What do you want me to carry? Nothing. You've got a lot of Forsworn stuff. That's it? Oh, this headdress almost. Almost forgot. There we go. You lead. I'll follow. Gore, do you have anything? Just leave me all the food. You know, you, you are a amulet of Mara duplication machine. Every time I take this, another one takes its place. We're going to have to find somebody for you. All right, this is... Uh, all right, then. I thought that iron staff we had already. Oh, we didn't have it, but anyway, let's go ahead and get stuff uh, situated here in the museum. Okay, four new displays, 206 items total. Still don't think I'm making any money, but anyhow, 
admire that new sword that you have. It's a good thing we found the uh, a new enchanter in Markarth, Caselmo. Now you have a, a stamina damage sword. That's really nice. So we're going to have to have him enchant all of our things. And it's amazing too because he can do double enchant and he's that good. Yes. All right. You need something. Have a good day. I don't miss my it's time for us to get to Markarth. No, Morthal. Keep it. Ah, good confused. day, my friend. Uh oh. The mercenaries came through town and sold their spoils, and my contacts informed me of a rare item amongst the hall. I thought you may want to use it, or perhaps place it on display. Okay, let me take a look at it. Eladon's Ward. Oh, wow, that's fancy. Increases your health by 75 points and health regeneration is 50% faster. Huh. You know, I'm tempted, but I, I don't know, does it? I really am quite partial to the wolf shield. I know, I won't touch it. Wow, hold on, let me, let me compare it. So, armor is 36, 50, no. Nah. I mean, that, that health stuff is good, but... I need a shield that can, can block damage. All right, let's go ahead and put this up. All right, there we go. Shield is on display. All right. Now, as I was saying before, we're off to Morthal. Time to cleanse the Empire of its filth. Oh no, what's going on? Well, that was certainly a, a rude welcome. What did they kill? Well, I see a Scott my sky shard over there. In this city. We can go north to the marsh and kill one if you're curious. A, a, a Chorus, no thank you. Those things are ugly. Did anybody see what it was they were attacking? I, I don't see a corpse anywhere. Okay, let's go over here and get this shard. Unless it's about the mill, I don't have time to talk. Too much to do. Sir, I was not even thinking about you. Uh, how do we get it? Shouting. All right, let's go ahead and get this. Yeah. Oh, I feel stronger and better already. Do we need to investigate the shouts? Is it? Oh! Who is that in there? Another one.
horse a, a honed ancient Nord mace. Or it needs this. All right, go. Well, I'm scared to give you guys weapons because <laughs> still you start, here. You start using them instead of the ones you have. What do you want me to carry? I really got to do something about my carry weight. This is crazy. Let's get going then. I thought there was another one over here, but I'm not going to worry about it. Still here? Yeah. What do you want me to carry? I'm sorry, Gore. I just don't trust you enough. One day. What is that thing? What did I pick up? I'm giving you this mace, too. Yeah, this ancient Nord bow. Okay, that should do for now. Thank you. You lead. I'll I'm, follow. I'm just kidding, buddy. Don't get mad. You know I trust you. With my life. Come on. stop picking these ingredients because I'm not an alchemist but you know it gets a addictive after a while you just you start once you start it's hard to stop hello who are you I'm the best warrior in Morthal and that's no boast okay all right then have a good day I'm not impressed Let's see what we got here on the message boards. Oh, a band is... Might as well take that while we're here. Oh, look at this. Two Nurn roots. I mean, I, I gotta pick them just to, to shut them up. Okay, let's go take a look inside the inn. Finally, someone comes in. Kick off your boots, stay a while. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. I got nothing but time these days. What is that over there? Very suspicious. Is there something I can do for you? No, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hmm. You see what I'm seeing? Is hmm. You're back again. I what do you think, need, Hansel? I don't know. Can we? Are we permitted to do this in plain view? Come on. So the rumors seem to be true. There are problems here. Let's follow up.
couldn't help it. And, you know, it'll make us look not so suspicious that I'm picking flowers. Morthal used to be a quiet place, but then the world used to make sense. Heard about mm. you and your honeyed words. Seems pretty quiet to me. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. God, if be standing you don't around mind rubbish. your business. We should be taken to fight to the Stormcloaks. Again, this bothers me that this citizen is walking around out here in broad daylight. Damn Stormcloak rebels. Every one of them. I wonder if we could follow her to her lair. There must be other vampires. They're never alone. But the problem is... Is the problem is I want to kill her. All right, come on through here. Let me close the gate. C come on. Cherry, you know, you just can be so difficult sometimes. You stay back there then. Are there any guards? Guard towers? I don't think so. Oh, maybe we should just follow up. I cannot believe it. A vampire walking around out here in broad daylight. Oh, look at that when I was in the dungeon skull. A bunch of the guards used to torture the prisoner in the cell next to mine. It wasn't you know, right. If it I didn't fair. know any better, I'd almost think she was luring us here. I mean, don't they have super senses and whatnot? She, I'm sure she knows we're back behind her. Get up. Is it getting hot? Or is it just me? Oh, I missed. Get up. Don't do that. She's gone. <sighs> she vanished into thin air. All right, I bet this is a vampire lair. Let's get back to Morthal and see what is going on and what they know. Come on. Finally, someone comes in. Kick off your boots, stay a while. Now, I was Let trying to check out this suspicious looking person here. Time these days. Is this another vampire? Stop Ooh. staring at me and tell me what you want. Who are you? I'm looking for work. You got any leads? So I got a lead on a contract in that last tavern. You want to go earn some gold the hard way? Oh, a giant, huh? Thanks. Whatever you say. That is quite an outfit. Um, excuse me, fellow Red God, Welcome hello. Welcome to the Moor side. If you need anything, I'll be around. Good to have a customer. There was a citizen in here that was a vampire. Did you know that? There ain't much to offer, but if you want a place dry to spend the night, I'll rent you a room. 
Running an inn weren't my plan, but Folian decided to move here, so I joined him. All right, well, let me try an easier question then. Before we came in here earlier, I saw a burned down house. Is there a story behind it? Rogar's house? Yes. It burned down not too long ago. Okay. It's a real pity about his wife and kid. The screams woke half the town. What? Most folk won't go near it now for fear it's cursed. How did the fire start? Rogar claims it was a hearth fire. Some folks say Rogar started it himself. With his own wife and child inside? That's what they say. See, he's living with Alva now. That started the day after the fire. It ain't what? right moving in with a new love the day after your kin die like no, that. No, it's not. That's suspicious. And of course, they can't prove he murdered them. Aye. Our Jarl would sure like to know if he did, though. Might even pay to find out. Hmm. All right, I think I'll talk to the Jarl then. If there's anything you need, I'd be glad to help you. Okay, well, this will do day. for now. Thank you. Oh, excuse me, ma'am. I'm very suspicious. I don't think she knew that that citizen was a vampire. Something strange is really going on here. Come on, let's go. This, there's the burned down house back there. Damn storm cloaks. Oblivion take them. Every miserable last one of them. <laughs> what a laugh. Damn storm cloak members. Right, let's uh, one of them. discover a few things here. Hey, you mix potions, right? No, no, I don't. What is it, Red God? Ugh. Been tending to your hounds? You smell like a wet dog. I'm gonna tend to you in a minute. Oh, this is, uh, actually Alva's house right here. house I find your wolfish grin unsettling you should didn't I hear about a phallion let's go in and see if you're here to purchase I have many spells available do come in wait why is that girl walking around like oh she's using magic Oh, a red guard. Hello. You are new to Morthal. We've not spoken before. If you stand before me to accuse me of sacrificing children or eating the hearts of the dead, you may save your breath. I have done no such thing, nor do I intend to. I simply wish to live my life in peace. Um, are, are you being serious right now? Why would anybody accuse you of that? The people of Morthal would much rather weave their own horrid tales about my life than simply ask me for the truth. If they choose to fear me in their ignorance, that's their choice. But it will not change what is true. Why set up shop in Morthal? As anyone will tell you, Morthal can be a dangerous place. My talents are useful here. I help maintain order, even if it goes unnoticed. <laughs> okay. Well, what can you tell me about the area? I'm here because I'm hearing some really uh, disturbing rumors. The marsh is treacherous. Mm. 
You would do well to not wander at night. I bet. There are vampires out there. Okay, well, thank you. Till next time. It's been a pleasure. See that outfit? When I grow up, will I go to the college in winter? Oh, that is nice. No, I don't think that will be necessary. Oh, oh but I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. About magic, and that's what they do What's there. The that Should is a help? really nice outfit. The college is not the only place to okay. learn about magic. Come on. But you went there, didn't you? What Isn't else has that he where got you learned? Here? I was there only this? for a short time. A wine marble learned, cheese wheel. I bet that's delicious. And I will teach you. And what's this? You have a, no reason a to A note. There. Can I read this without him attacking me? I recently received this cheese from a man I helped cure as a gift for services rendered. He claimed that it was made with fine wine, but also said that he wouldn't be needing it anymore. Well, that is suspicious. That's enough. What's this? Oh, really? Chris a phrase. Chris a f whatever. Something that Orion would want, but I'm not gonna go in here and steal all this stuff. Not with the man standing right there. That is really a nice outfit, though. And look at the little girl. Look at her. Practicing magic. All right, come on. We're probably making him uneasy. Let's go. Hail, companion. Hail. You know, it looks like the companions need to spend some time here in Morthal with all that's going on. I suppose I could encourage them to come here since there's the <laughs> leader. Hello. Hi. Oh, look at you. You can, uh, a blacksmith, huh? All right. What have you got for sale? The finest weapons and armor. Hunting bow of havoc. <laughs> wow. Huh. Iron Mall of Momentum. Some interesting things. Resistance to magic increases health. All right, thank mm -hmm. you, sir. All right, I'm getting distracted. We need to go in here and talk to the Yarl. Damn Stormcloak rebels, every one of them. You need to leave. What do you mean we need to leave? We're here to help. I'm with the companions. Sir. If you've business with the Jarl, I'd ask that you speak to me first. Okay. What was that argument and, and fighting and everything that was going on outside the hall? Ah, you saw that, did you? Could Life help in Morthal has been troubled lately. The people are uncertain, restless. They merely look to the Jarl for leadership. What's going wrong in Morthal? There's news of rebellion against the Empire. Strange noises have been heard in the marshes at mm -hmm. night. Here we go. And then, the tragedy with Rogar's home. The men simply seek wisdom. Everything will be fine. Well, this seems like a, a quiet little town. That's what many here wanted. A quiet life in a quiet place without the noise or the trouble of a city. Now some worry this wizard, Folion, will foul it all up. What? Folion? Wow, so he was right. They are against him. Mm-hmm. May I speak to Her Majesty, please? Thank you. So, life has brought you to Morthal and to me. What purpose this serves, we will no doubt see. Welcome. Thank you, your majesty. Tamriel is full of wisdom and magic, if one is willing to look for it. Few have their eyes open. Yes. 
because no path is darker than when your eyes are shut. Anyhow, I hear you want someone to look into that house fire. Broger's house fire? Yes, yeah, he that lost one. lost his wife and daughter in the blaze. Yeah, I heard. My well, people believe it's tragic. been cursed now. Who am I to gainsay them? Who are you? What does Rogar say happen? Rogar blames his wife for spilling bear fat in the fire. Many bear folk fat. think he set the fire himself. Uh-huh. And why would he do that to his own family? Lust can make a man Lust. do the unthinkable. Wow. The ashes were still warm when he pledged himself to Alva. So why haven't you arrested him? On rumor and gossip? Yes. No. But you, a stranger, might find the truth for us. Circumstantial the evidence. That others are too fearful to touch. See what they tell you. Should you prove him guilty or innocent, I will reward you. Well, okay. I've been hearing rumors. Is there some kind of trouble in Morthal? That which is unknown can create unease, even fear. It is to be expected. Some fear our new resident wizard. No, not Valian they grow again. To know him, they will accept him. Time will prove me right. I mean, it, it, he seems like a decent person once you get past that, uh... Oh, those walls that he has up and he wants to attack people because he thinks that they're going to attack him but you know we're red gods I'm, I'm not here as an enemy alright but anyway I'm sure I'll solve this in no time I'm very good at this kind of thing then stop wasting my time oh how dare I mean you business with the yard right. I'd ask that you speak to me first I already spoke to you Y'all are getting on my nerves. Come, come on, let's go. So, what's next? All right, we're gonna go investigate this burned house. Keep your eyes out. I know there are more vampires around here. Rogar said that this is where the fire started, but given that the wooden mantle seems barely touched by the flames, this seems unlikely. Hmm. So it didn't start here at the fireplace. Are there other clues here? floor here is especially damaged. This may be where the fire began, right next to what used to be a window. Who's there? What? A ghost? Who, who are you? Helgi, the father says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Are you a stranger? Um... I am actually a stranger, but I'm here to help. Father says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Of course. Who's there? Is that you, Father? <laughs> Hello, Helgi. I remember you. You're the stranger. Father says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Oh, aren't you a witty little girl? Is Rogar your father? You know him? He made my favorite dolly, but I can't find her. Hmm. Are you sure you aren't a stranger? No, I'm not a stranger. 
I'm a friend. Do you know what happened to your house? The smoke woke me up. I was hot and I was scared. So I hid. Then it got cold and dark. I'm not scared anymore. But I'm lonely. Will you play with me? Hmm. You know what? Why you why it got cold and dark, Helgi? It's because you died. Anyhow, if I if I do play with you, will you tell me who set the fire? Okay, let's play hide and seek. You find me and I'll tell you. We have to wait for nighttime though. The other one is playing too, and she can't come out until then. Nighttime can't come out. Uh-huh. The other one, what do you mean? I can't tell you. She might hear me. She's so close. If you can find me first, I can tell you. Wait. She's gone. All right, isn't it dark? It's like ghosts really can't tell time, can they? All right, you two. You did see the ghost, right? Heard it? Now, where is Rogar, anyway, to talk to him? But who is this here? Could that be him? Have you seen Leia Lynn? Have you seen my oh. wife? No. You're not Rogar. Trouble. Are you? Are you Rogar? Have you seen Leia Lynn? Have you seen my wife? What troubles you? I'm just a poor man trying to make a living. I'd leave Mortal were it in my power. This damned war has cost us, me, everything. My boy is to grow up without a mother? What life is that? It's not right, I tell you. What happened to your wife? Hasn't been seen for a while. She just vanished without a trace. Some say the swamp took her. Part of me wishes it were that simple. What else could it be? You know, so something is very wrong here. Who, who is this? Is this the... You I do what I can to see that Idgrud's time isn't wasted, and that she only okay. has to deal with important matters. All right, I'm sorry. I was looking for Rogar. Now, who is this? Well, that's the blacksmith. Said something about uh, committing to Alba. Yeah, that's Thonir again. And I think we saw a home over here that said Alba on the door. Yeah, it's this one. Oh boy. Oh, that's a guard right there. Oh well. The last thing I need is to spend the night in jail. All right, we're not going to be able to talk to him. Because that guard doesn't look like he's going anywhere anytime soon. All right, it's getting dark out here. Let's see if we can't find Helgi. I'm going to need a lantern. I wonder if Rogar would be in the, the Let bar. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. Somebody's about to steal yours. It's like if I didn't have to go to jail, I would certainly uh, take yeah, care of you. Finally, someone comes in. Kick off your boots, stay a while. Uh, Let me know if there's anything I can help well, you. Well, it sounds like I'm this place is empty then. No, Rogar. Who is this? Hi. Hello. Probably should talk to you, though, yes? sir. 
Is there something bothering you? There is uh, a problem, yes. Really? I'm worried about it, and I don't know what to do. What's the problem? She is so lost in her visions, and it's only getting worse. I've looked after her safety for so long. If she can't tell what's real and what's not, how will she continue to lead Hjalmar? Hmm. And lady, you need to move on. I'm not listening to you. Is there anything I can do? Yes. I suppose there is. There is a letter. One I have had for some time now. I think it is time it gets delivered. I cannot leave Idgrid's side, so I must stay here. Could you see that it reaches Captain Aldous in solitude? Oh, okay, sure. I, I know Captain Aldous. I'll see that he gets it. Thank you. Uh, please, do not open it. It is... You tempt me mightily, Alpha, but I wouldn't cuckold another man. Okay. Murderer like Got it. <laughs> All right, then. And in. Uh, you, you again? Sleeping. Hello, sir. And more importantly, Wait. what are we eating? Wait a minute. Hello, Excuse ladies. me. Is Who are you? A big, strong man can do for you this fine day? Well, aren't you the hand? The people here Who work so you? hard, and they never allow themselves a moment of fun. <laughs> it's such a pity. It won't last forever, though. So you are, Alva. They say that Krogar burned down his house for you. Do they? How delightful. What? I'm lucky to have a man that is so devoted to me. It's Why, you... You believe this? These p gathering plants, picking mushrooms, brewing potions, it all gets so dreary after a while. This town needs something exciting to happen. Until next time. I need you to look me in the yes. eye. Need something? <clears throat> Until next time. What? You look human. What do you need, handsome? I just wanted to look closely in your eyes. Hi there. How is that possible? What do you think she's using an illusion spell? Mortal's mask? Yeah, I'm thinking that too. Look at her. Just flaunting her freedom. I know she's behind all this. That's the thing about these vampires. They're so shameless. Destroyed my entire village and killed my family. I just can't stand it. I can't stand around and let this continue to happen. They must be destroyed. Come on, let's go. It's like there's nothing I can do in an inn with people. I can't say it's full of people, but. Well, I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. You know what? If Alva is here, let's see if that god moved on. Oh, hey, Valley. Morthal is a troubled place. It's my duty to see it rest in peace. Do you know anything about vampires here in Morthal? Oh, you have your suspicions, all right. All right, then. Yeah. It's not very helpful. Oh, look, the guard is... Oh, this is the guard house. No wonder the guard's standing there. Can 
they really see this far? Oh, yeah, one's, one's coming this way. All right, never mind. You like me, eh? Don't fancy those clunky two-handed weapons. You know I tried. All right, so let's look for, um... Helgi. Wait. Oh, it's Rogar. I thought you might... Hello? I, I'm not one for talk. Try to keep to myself. I heard you burned your house down. That's true, but I'm in a new house now. A better house. Really? What about your wife and child? Yeah, that was a shame. You but don't sound like it was. Of me and I take care of her. Really? I've spoken with the ghost of your daughter, Helgi. Really? How nice. You don't even care. She's your daughter. I have Alva to take care of now. I don't need Helgi anymore. What? I've seen the burned down house for myself, and your story doesn't match. Ah, I see. Whatever happened before doesn't matter. Now, what did you say you wanted? I see you don't plan to cooperate. Mm-hmm. Until next time. He's a vampire thrall. Come on. Where? Oh. We gotta find Helgi on our own, huh? Kill him and Alva. It's a shame that I can't. Uh-oh. I know that, uh... That cold. I'm you. Back off. You're warning me. Get off. You have no me. idea who you're was dealing to find with. Me too, but I'm glad you found me first. That was Laylette? Can you tell me what happened? Layla was told to burn Mommy and me, but he didn't what? want to. He wanted to play with me forever and ever. He kissed me on the neck, and I got so cold that the fire didn't even hurt. Leila thought he could you. take me and keep me, but he can't. I'm all burned up. Well, thank you, Helgi. I swear I'll get to the bottom of this. I'm tired. I'm going to sleep for a while now. Yeah, you do that. There's a coffin. Okay, come on. So that was Laylette, a full vampire. So now we know what happened to her. Let's see if we can't find a Mr. Laylette. Still over here. Have you seen Leolet? Have you seen my wife? Don't know. Mr. Leolet. About Leolet. Come to the graveyard. I'm sorry. 
Oh no. By the gods, this can't be happening. over here. But where's he going now? Uh, I'm sorry, it's this ash pile over here. Wait, left. She's dead. He's your beard. She's she's a vampire. Yes. Yes, I'm sorry. She's dead. Layalette is dead. Yes. What can you tell me about your wife? Layalette. I thought she left to join the Stormcloaks. Oh, my poor Laylet. Did you notice anything strange before she left? She began to spend a lot of time with Alva. Yet just a week before, she despised her. In fact, the night she disappeared, she was supposed to meet Alva. Alva told me later, that she never showed up. I never got to tell her goodbye. Hmm. Well, if my suspicions are correct, I think they may have met after all. You think Alva? Yes, I think but so. that means... Ye gods! Yes. You think Alva is a yes. vampire? Yes. Absolutely. It's a possibility we can't ignore. No. You're wrong. I'm right. You must be wrong. I'm I am right. Layalette may have met her fate out in the marsh. I refuse to believe Alva you had anything to do with You know I'm right. Stop this. it. There is no way Stop you it. can be quiet. the Jarl. I hope Alva is not what you think. She is. Just just give in into what you know is true. You know it deep down in your heart that Alva is a vampire. I talked to her earlier that her smug, arrogant disposition, definitely that of a vampire. And then poor old Rogar is completely enthralled by her. Wake up, man. Wake up. <laughs> 